Yes! There's my favorite boy! The answer is tea time! <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. My name is Anna, and today we are going to be setting up for Stray Kids' new comeback in November, Rockstar, which I'm so excited for. Like, don't get me wrong, your girl is so freaking excited. I'm so happy, but like, oh my gosh, like the album inclusions, the amount of photo cards that we have this time around it's it's a lot it's a lot it's completely different from what Stray Kids have done before, but honestly, kind of like the same thing. Like, they just added. Like, they didn't take anything away, they added. And I'm just like, oh, okay, whatever. But let's get into it. I'm so excited to just hear the new music, honestly, and see what's going on. But yeah, let's go into the album inclusions. So, for Stray Kids' newest mini album, Rockstar, there are five album versions it's Rock, Roll, Limited Star Version, the eight postcard versions and the newest edition the headliner version let's get started with the rock and roll versions because they go hand in hand together for both the rock and roll version you get a photo book a cd one out of 16 photo cards a panorama mini poster one sticker sheet and a random one out of four unit cards for the pre-order benefit only there are three types of folded posters and a film photo card set if you remember in maxident the polaroids I have a feeling it's going to be like that. However, they're going to be giving us two sets of Polaroids this time around. So every album, you'll be getting random one out of two sets of Polaroids. Moving on to the limited version, everything is the same like the rock and roll versions, including the pre-order only exclusives. There are eight special mini posters and you only get one random mini poster in one album. So instead of the mini posters being in all of the albums, they will only be in the limited version. And lastly, for the limited version, there's going to be a four cut photo film. Going on to the postcard versions, they're exactly like the Digipack versions in Five Star. Instead of getting a member specific photo book, it's going to be a member specific postcard set. Along with the postcards, you'll get one out of eight CDs, a lyrics paper, a mini folded poster, and random one out of eight photo cards. For the pre-order benefit only exclusive, you'll get another random one out of eight photo cards. So exactly like last era's digipacks. Onto the last version, the headliner version, you'll get a photo book, one CD, one folded mood board poster, and a random one out of eight photo cards. With all that said, Let's get back to Viviana. So, how did you guys like it? Was it cool? Was it fire? Should I not do it again? Uh, just let me know down in the comments below. But as you can see, yeah, it is a lot of photo cards. It's literally 60, including the units. But it's 56 without, but it's still, it's still hot. It's still a lot if you're collecting OT8. If you're collecting one member, it's, it's seven. You'll be, <laughs> it's okay. It, and it's also just a lot of new versions well technically they added like one extra version uh but just crazy because there's only 24 pages in that one extra version it's it's ridiculous let's just get into it i'm i do have some white fillers i have some handy dandy post-it notes you know and then i have my pen so i'm going to time skip all of this but like low-key i do kind of suggest like if you're watching me you might as well you know get ready with me like do this with me let's do this as a collective don't just watch me go ahead get your binder out girl get your post-it notes get your white fillers let's let's get to it because listen skits is coming in november we gotta hurry this up okay um but yeah let's just get into it i'm gonna start writing and i hate writing sometimes but yes <laughs>
Okay, so I am back with doing all of my fillers. Oh my gosh, so much fillers. It's literally ridiculous, but uh, whatever. So I do have nine, nine pocket pages in, um, in my hand right now. So that's fun. Uh, let's go to the back. I don't know where to put these out. We're like, oh, where should I put these? We're gonna go all the way to the back. All the way to the back, all the way. Oh my gosh. And then I did, as you saw, I did already get ready for my OT8 pre-order benefits that I'm going to be getting because of the postcard versions. And then my uh, OT3 pre-order benefit sets that I usually get um, every era. This was the era last time this is five star era so this is target this is rfp pops and then these were the um, bartender ones so i did do that that's fun let's just get into it i genuinely knew for a fucking fact let me tell you this now i knew for a fact that they were going to have a repackage because you know ain't no way right like ain't no way that they were going to come out here with a whole new, like whole new album. Like just ain't no way. Like I knew for a fact they were gonna do that shit. And they haven't done a repackage in so long, since In Life. So it's, it's, it's weird. It's weird to me. I'm happy that they're coming out with some more music, but I feel like they did so, so freaking much this year that we already knew that they were gonna come out again this year, but it's just, it's just a lot. And they came back with this. So I'm trying to figure out like how much, no, that's not it. 
um, how much new songs do you think, realistically, that we're going to get on this new album? Realistically. Because I'm over here like, how much was, like, new songs were there in the first, like, in, in life? I don't know. Oh, and if you're wondering why I'm putting these units in the, like, in the middle, it's just because I don't want to do a whole four pocket page bullshit four units. So, the band. They will be in the middle for now until I figure out. But right now, I'm just kind of trying to get them all in. Just trying to get them all in. But, yeah. I can't wait. Don't get me wrong. Like, I can't wait for the new music, but damn. And Rockstar? What? <laughs> the, uh, the trailer was so cute. The two men, the little fight scene that two men had. What were they fighting over? Was that a camera? That was that. That wasn't a blick, right? It was a camera. It could have been a blick, right? Like I'm thinking, like no way, it's a blick. But shit, I don't know. My eyes be deceiving me sometimes. I have poor eyes. I have poor eyesight. Um, but they look so adorable. Honestly, Sigma being so happy it just makes me happy. But we already know that. If you are on this channel. Like, the name is Single Puppy for a reason. Like, <laughs> of course I'm happy with Singin's Happy the Fuck. But, yeah, they did so freaking much. They did so much album versions this time around. It's ridiculous. What is going on with the headliner version? Why, why is there a new version, album version? Like, I just, I'm confused. And then, and then, they, wait, I did something, I got, what? Wait, did I never do? <sighs> okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and do Jisung's version, like, photo card thing thing later. Um, I'm kind of upset that you guys didn't let me know. I just want you to know that. I'm actually really upset at you guys. And it's just like, where is the love? Because there's no love. Like, y'all saw me blatantly not write this man down. Okay, I'm just, I'm over it. I'm over it. Let's keep going. Let's act like that didn't just happen. But I just, yeah, I don't know. Like that extra version was so like, yeah, I didn't have to do that. And then the one photo card per album is so evil. <laughs> it's so evil. Like I genuinely like JYP, you guys ain't shit for that. Like it's so evil. And then you have so many different versions. And I'm just like, please don't let this be an ATs thing, <laughs> please. Like, I be seeing ATs, and I just be like, like hyping y'all up because y'all really be out here doing the most, doing the most. And I just be, I be feeling for y'all because I know for a fact I can't do it. Like, I know ATs had so much more than like the 60 that I'm crying over right now, but it's just like Skiz never done this before, so it's just like, whoa, that's a little too much, don't you think? And then they're like, not enough, and I'm like, okay. Thank you for letting me know that. We can go ahead and put a white sleeve in it now. Yay. Yay. I mean, if it goes in, if it goes in, but, oh my gosh, okay, okay. Let me tell you guys, oh my gosh. Today, oh my gosh, I'm so, so freaking happy. So, you know, um, the pre-order benefits started today at 9 p.m. on October, technically, yeah. 9 p.m. October, well, well, my my time, 9 p.m. October 5th, but the pre-orders started October 6th, 1 p.m. Korean time. So yeah, your girl was, oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Like I literally got three signed versions. They're all postcards, but I am just so excited because I've never had like a signed Stingman thing before. And um, the way I was shaking, as I, like right when nine hit, I like shaking. I'm trying to get everything. I, I'm grabbing my phone because I was literally doing my sister's hair. Stop that! I was like, get the hell out the way. <laughs> I got I got albums to buy, right? So I push her ass. I didn't push her, but like I was like, mm, done with your hair right now. Get out, got her out the way. Grab my phone. Go on Skid's shop, and I and like it took like probably like ten seconds to really like get on the website and i was like oh my gosh please hurry up hurry up hurry up because i'm thinking that it's going to be sold out in this in like the span of like two minutes like a minute like which is like no dirt like it's not going to be but whatever 
So I'm I get on the freaking website and I buy I grab the first three signed versions and I think it was the rock versions, the pink one. And I was like, whatever, I don't care. I grab three because I'm going to be uh collecting my OT3 for the signed versions. And as I'm putting in my information, my hands are shaking and I'm like, kid you not, act like this is my phone. I was like this. Like literally like trying <laughs> my hardest to put in my information to buy these freaking albums and I'm just like all over the place and tell me why as I'm about to click pay I was like oh shit I totally forgot like I have my card locked so I literally go to my like my bank whatever app and I unlock it I'm like oh my gosh does this take forever like it felt like it took years to for the car to unlock but it really didn't but i was like i swear to god if if that one fumble screwed up me getting these albums i will mm, mm, i'm gonna I'm have a temper tantrum i don't care i don't i don't care how i am 22 have me a temper tantrum guess what i will do that i don't care for stray kids yeah i'm just gonna no but um I confirmed it, I secured it, I was so happy, but Jesus freaking Christ, I was so stressed, I was so nervous, I was so like anxious, I don't like being nervous or anxious, I really don't, that's just not me, um, so me being nervous and anxious, buying those albums, I hated that, I didn't deserve that, that was just not, no, no, that just wasn't fair to me, but i'm so excited cannot wait to uh, collect my ot3 for that i'm going which is uh i hate saying this but not hate saying this but it's gonna it's gonna kill me literally if i don't do not pull mino i am going to have to uh, make sure that he's like i'm going to have to oh my gosh why am i blanking what's the word yeah, bear me a minute. I'll be blanking a lot on my words. I'm going to prioritize Mino. You know, okay, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to prioritize this man. Even if I don't even pull Sigmund, I'm going to have to prioritize Mino. You know, and it's going to be Sigmund, and then it's going to be Jongen. Uh, I hate saying that. <laughs> because, like, honestly, like, I, I know for a fact I probably won't prioritize you know i've said that multiple times i'm gonna prioritize him and then like i'll see a sigmund thing i'm like nope <laughs> just kidding i don't have that one let me grab it and it's so bad like i really really can't like if i don't have s stuff for a sigmund i'm like nope gotta grab that first like he's will forever be like the person that i prioritize because he's my ult of ult so that kind of makes sense but Genuinely, I need to make sure I do get Minos because I really, really don't want to be struggling trying to find a like a trade for him, especially with Instagram. Instagram is literally pissing me the fuck off. I just, I can't with the Instagram thing. I really can't. It's just irritating AF. Oh my gosh, but yeah, I'm so excited. Oh, I don't need these. Wait, I do need these. How much space does that do? Yeah, whatever. So, <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. I'm just over here like still pumped on wait i'm so confused that's not it that's not right okay so yeah still pumped on it i was so dude i woke up and i woke up early today and i was like oh i'm better go to sleep and then i go on my instagram because i love checking just in case and i have to check anyways because my social path gone um they said that they got in the albums and they're like whoever like does the form first gets prio on like the album cards i'm like oh let me go ahead and do that so i did that i was like probably like 55 minutes late so i was i'm hoping because it was like eight o'clock but like i was hoping nobody else <laughs> i feel so bad for them saying that but like i hope everyone was knocked still <laughs> so i was able to um oh my gosh please go in so i was able to get that priority for semen because you know your girl needs semen i'm only doing semen so i was like oh hopefully but yeah so i was on i did my form and then i saw shake has dropped like a whole teaser and i was like uh, uh, excuse me what a teaser they dropped what when i was asleep dead, in, dead sleep <laughs> i go oh my gosh let me tell you chanlicks deserve an oscar like they deserve an oscar they did 
they literal shit on the teaser. Oh my gosh, Chani, Chani, Chani took the whole cake with it. He did so well, and I'm so proud of him. I'm literally proud of them, like the way, and they they brought back the, like the little the little boy. I'm so happy for that. Like I bet you Changbin was just like ah, uh, just so happy to be around him. But oh my gosh, they did they shit. I loved the. The, the teaser, the teaser was gorgeous. I love the teaser, honestly. And um, giving rock vibes. It's giving me Maxident super bored vibes. Like low key, like I feel like they're going to do songs that have those types of vibes. And if they don't, well then damn, my bad. My bad for wishing. But if they do, yes, I literally love that. I literally love Super Superboard. Or it's Give Me Your TMI. They need to do more songs like Give Me Your TMI. I love Give Me Your TMI. I have been just out here listening to all of their music for like on repeat for a hot minute for a couple months, <laughs> which is crazy. Like I literally like wake up and listen to Collision. Like I try and I, I have been listening to Collision daily like that's like one song that i will literally listen to daily ever since it came out ever since sigmund released that fire ass song because that's my favorite song like ever i'm pretty sure like ever collision does just does stuff for me like collision is my type of song but yeah ever since that song came what is this marshmallow here my dog's marshmallow but jesus <laughs> jesus christ marshmallow jesus christ but um, ever since Collision came out, I've been listening to that. And I've been listening to Five Star on repeat. I've been listening to Accident, like their whole, like their whole discography on repeat. I just need to let y'all know. Skiz, oh my gosh, they're so good. They're good at what they do, honestly. And then they won the MTV Awards, which I'm so happy they deserve it. Because they, them bitches, like they are bad bitches. Like you can't tell me nothing. Like every single one of them are bad bitches. You can't tell me shit. And if you want to tell me shit, I'm not listening. So sorry, ears plugged. I'm not listening. Don't care. Um, but yeah, that's that's. <laughs> I feel I feel so bad. I said that. Okay. Anyways, but yeah, that's it. There's nine. I need to do this. Don't don't look. Do not look. But fuck, fuck me, fuck me. Okay. So yeah, that's it. Nine full pages that I'm going to have to worry about next era. Next month. Oh my gosh. Like I'm excited. Don't get me wrong, but I'm I feel like it's going to be a little stressful. Only because of the one photo card you get an album. I think it's just so messed up. But I'm gonna do it and I already bought stuff because I'm a clown, as you can tell in the teaser. That was basically, they basically got stays from off the streets and was like, do y'all wanna be in our music videos? And then you know damn well, like they didn't have to put no makeup or, or nothing. That is just their faces <laughs> because we're all clowns. But that's okay, that's okay. Like stays, like stray kids know that we're clowns and they love us for that. So I'm happy for that. But uh, other than that, that is it for this video. Sorry, I talk a lot. I talk a lot. I don't know why, but that's just that's just me, you know. But uh, thank you guys so much. The next video, it's either going to be the, the rock star video or my Japanese video, like album cards video. Either way, I will see you in most likely in November. So, <laughs> peace.